so much for tuning in to the Christian Women Alliance talk show. We're so excited that you joined us today, where we support women, we build up. We're so glad that you tuned in, and we have our special guest with us um, today, Miss Katrina Vaughn. We're so glad to have you. Thank you. Uh, and Miss Katrina Vaughn is going to share with us today just the importance of having a business, especially as a woman. But before we dive into that, can you just tell us a little bit about yourself, where you're from, and uh, you know, your, your childhood and things of that nature. Okay, um, I am originally from the state of New York. Wow. Um, that's where I was born. Uh, me and my mom moved to North Carolina at a very early age because that's her hometown. So I was born in the city and raised in um, the South. So wow, I'm kind of like a city country girl, <laughs> if you will. Um, and I currently live in the Washington, D.C. area in the state of Maryland. I've been living there for 25 plus years. So that's, you know, where I am now. Okay, so. wow. Um, what do you feel like is the importance of women starting businesses? What, what has attracted me to you is when I first met you, just such, a, such an entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. um, you were very uh, educated and about what you were presenting on um, the products and seeing just women's lives being bettered and improved. Why do you think it's so important to start businesses, especially when you look at uh, the economy and things they're doing? People are depending upon a nine to five, but you're going to have to have multiple streams of income in order just to survive and move forward. Absolutely. Um, I think one of the things that's really, really important and why it's important for a woman to, you know, start her own business is because it gives a great sense of empowerment. Wow. You know, it gives a great sense of empowerment. I always think that, you know, a woman should position herself where she can have multiple streams of income, mm -hmm. you know, to be able to take care of herself, her family, her children. Um, it's just uh, added value uh, thing in being an entrepreneur. So I think that's what makes it really, really important. Important, just real self empowerment. Wow, and, and you're absolutely right because especially during the time now, it takes not only one income, sometimes it takes two incomes in order for a house to function. Then also, we're dealing with a society sometimes where women think that they have to have multiple men to take care of them absolutely. when God had provided vehicles where you can take care of yourself. If you were talking to a woman, what would you tell them the five important things you need in place when starting a business? Because oftentimes you find people, oh, I'm going to start a business. They've done no planning, no strategizing, no educating themselves in order that they can move successfully into business. What are five things you, you would say you've got to have this in order to move forward in business? Um, the first thing that comes to mind is a great sense of belief. Wow. Um, just believing in yourself that whatever it is that you put your hands to, put your minds to, that you can actually accomplish it. I also think that it's really, really important for you to have a plan, a business plan, wow. you know, to know where you're going, what you want to accomplish, the market that you really want to target. I think it's really, really good to have a, to be connected to a network, wow. a network of individuals that can help to promote um, your business. That's really, really important. It's also important for you to um, have good credit. You know, good credit because a lot of times, you know, we go into business and it takes money to make money. So you want to be able to position yourself to um, be able to get loans and, to, you know, get yourself um, together where you can actually receive some capital. And the other thing I think is just having a great sense of perseverance because it's not always easy to, to be a business owner or for a woman to even function in this corporate world, in this society. So I think if you have a great sense of uh, perseverance, those are like the key elements to winning as an entrepreneur. Wow. What are some of your challenges you had? I mean, you're booming and busting through the seams now. But just for that entrepreneur that's starting out or somebody that's watching and said, oh, I want to start a business. What were some of the challenges that you had? Uh, one of the biggest challenges um, that I had, that I faced, was just raising my sons by myself. Wow. You know, just being that single parent and taking care of them and providing for them and, and learning information and training myself and studying. Yeah. Those are the things that were really, really challenging on the front side. But again, when you have that... Um, belief system and when you have that spirit of perseverance you know you can accomplish anything that you want to do so I think that was like my my greatest challenge just managing everything and having a work-life balance wow. and 
that's amazing how you just shared how you were a single parent, but yet you persevered and moved forth with your family. I think that's just incredible. How does having a business empower you? Um, you know, having a business, there's so many uh, things that come into play when you are actually running your own business. Um, but for me, it gives me a great sense of ownership. Mm -hmm. Like I have something that, you know, I can take charge of. Um, I don't have all of my rel of, uh, alliance with an employer, mm -hmm. you know, relying on them. It gives me a pow empowerment because I feel self-sufficient. Wow, you so know, important. like I, c I feel like the sky is the limit. Yeah. There's no one holding me back. A lot of times in the corporate world, you have a lot of politics, a lot of different things that take place in the workplace. But having my own business, my own baby, yeah. I can take it <laughs> and I can control it. And again, the sky is the limit. So that gives me a great sense of empowerment. Wow. And, and then even as you're empowered, you empower others by knowing you're bringing them quality and that you're educating them the best and you have their best interests at, at heart. Um, so we need businesses like yours. Can you right now just tell our viewers a little bit about your business and some of your products and how these products can help them, but also how they can come on the bandwagon and get involved and maybe start their own business? Actually, yes. Um, I am a part of a um, business called Five Links, and we have um, a variety of products, um, health and wellness products, telecommunications products, um, you know, health services products. I love that chocolate uh, smoothie. <laughs> <laughs> a, a lot of different things that um, we offer to people that help them save money. We know that in this economy, sometimes it's challenging, you know, to get your footing and to get your money right, but we offer for products and services that people use every single day. Um, it's really life-changing and with this lucrative opportunity I've seen so many people's lives change as you know as far as being a part of the five links business again we are empowering men and women all over the country saving lives changing lives just based on our product and things that we offer, things to help you get your money right, things to help you get your, your wellness right, your health right. Those are the things that we actually offer. And it's, it's really, really exciting to be able to offer something that will be instrumental in the growth and transformation of individuals' lives. Wow, I just saw you were at a conference with Five Links. I mean, I was looking through the pictures, living, living vicariously. I was like, she's just having a ball. But it seems like the carotidly and the family and the unity of driving that business and those business owners together is just amazing. Yes, it is. Um, you have some products there. Can you just share with uh, the viewers some of the products that they may be uh, interested in and what can help their bodies? Because we're firm believers as women, not only moving in business, but making sure that your spiritual house and your physical house is in order. Um, one of the, the biggest segments of our business is our health and wellness product. Um, we have a lot of products that we actually offer to a lot of people um, across the country. And just to mention just a few, we have our High Five Boost. Um, just to say, let me just say this, the wellness division is a trillion dollar industry wow. within the U.S. A lot of people are really into fitness, looking good, feeling good, and so um, this company allows us to operate and function within a trillion dollar industry. So we have a high five boost. So for all of you workout and gym bunnies out there, <laughs> this gives you lots of energy. We have a high five fuel. Um, this gives an instant um, burst of energy. It's really, really good. No sugar. Um, Gluten free is really, really good. Helps and that's the what body. I love. She said no sugar and no gluten sugar. free. Those are things that you you want in your body. You don't want to put things in your body that's going to destroy it, but you want to put things in your body that's going to build it up. That's really a good product. Absolutely. And this is one of our super duper products. It's called the High Five Edge. It helps with a number of things, but uh, definitely to um, improve your cognitive function. Um, it helps with anti aging. And you need that because I can go in a room and forget <laughs> what day it is. <laughs> absolutely absolutely um so it you know just helps with anti-aging your cognitive function you know a lot of different things packed with antioxidants it has a powerful ingredient called niagen so feel free to google that and see what that ingredient is all about but we're really big and we're really excited about sharing our wellness products with everybody that we come in contact to contact with 
could you give um, our audience your Facebook or your uh, website so that they can contact you on how to get these fabulous programs? Absolutely. Also, you can look down at our lower uh, thirds and see the information on how to contact her as well. Okay. So my website is www.5links, that's L-I-N-X, dot net forward slash become more. That's www.5links.net forward slash become more. Wow. You've told us about your product, but how about that person watching and say, I want to sell this product. Abs Not only do I want to take this product, but I want to drive this product. Absolutely. We have a phenomenal business opportunity associated with all that we do. And so if you're inter interested in getting more information about the Five Links Opportunity, feel free to contact me at www.5links.net forward slash become more. Or you can reach me at 240-988-7726. I'll be more than glad to share the opportunity with you. Again, we do two things. We help people save money and we also help those individuals that are interested in making money. Wow. So get her out at your conference, get her out at your health fair, get her out at your bazaar, get her out to your women's group, anything where you want to promote wellness and also help women to be empowered to start their own businesses. How many years have you been doing this? I've been doing this business now for about five years. Awesome. Five years. I love doing what I do. I love connecting to people to help uh, empower people. And so it's been a good run and I'm just getting started. Oh, wow. Just getting started. Okay. She's told you about her great products. She's told you how you can get involved and start selling these products. What made you choose this company? What made me choose this company is because I really like the diversity of their product and service portfolio. They have a lot of universal uh, products out there. So it was more than just being a part of a company that just basically specializes in one or two products. Mm -hmm. But because of the product portfolio and um, I was paying bills every month on these same services wow. that I actually, you know, were using. So to be able to generate income from a bill that I was currently paying, that was just like the, the, the deal breaker there. So it just made sense. Wow. <laughs> Well, we hope that you enjoyed today's broadcast where we dealt with the few things that will empower women. You know, we build up in the areas of health, ministry, partnership, and community. And so we thought it was befitting to bring this awesome entrepreneur to just talk to you about starting your mind thinking about starting your business or how to drive your business or other business opportunities. Again, Katrina Vaughn, look her up on her uh, Facebook and her website. Check these products out. They're incredible. Again, you're watching CWA Talk Show. We build up. Arts is excited about the release of our first movie, Caught Up, Memoirs of a Preacher's Wife. We would like to invite you to join our fan club on today. Your membership entitles you to become qualified for prizes and free movie merchandise. Everyone who joins our fan club will receive a Caught Up, Memoirs of a Preacher's Wife button as a tool to assist us in promoting the film. Do you have team building skills and like to win free items? Become a team captain, build your fan club team and partake in monthly incentives and prizes. Once your team reaches 10 members, every team captain will receive a free Memoirs of a Preacher's Wife t-shirt. In addition to this free t-shirt, everyone on the team is entitled to receive a shirt at a discounted rate. There will be monthly team games to win prizes and to help promote the movie. We will be hosting a meeting with all of our team captains to show them how to register and how to register their teams on our website. We thank you for taking time out to learn more about the Caught Up Memoirs of a Preacher's Wife fan club. Again, we thank you and we look forward to working with you in helping us spread the word about this wonderful film, Caught Up Memoirs of a Preacher's Wife.
in the beginning, Monica and Raymond had it all. They were living happily. Times were good. So it seems. seems. But little did they know, in a web of lies, someone would get caught up. Caught I have a warrant for your arrest. I don't want to talk to no attorney. You need to explain to me what's going on, Monica. You need to save the house, okay? Get out! Everything and that you're perfect. Maybe I wouldn't want a divorce. A divorce? Hmm. Music and art presents, presents caught up, caught up memoirs of a preacher's wife. Preacher's wife. That's my wife. A chance music and media group production. production. Have your attention we have one question for you are you caught up 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 get caught up on november the 10th 2016 at the world premiere of Caught Up Memoirs of a Preacher's Wife. You do not want to miss this exclusive red carpet black tie movie premiere taking place at the Paragon City Center at 11810 Fountain Way in Newport News, Virginia. There will be two screenings, one at 7 p.m. and 9.30 p.m. We will have celebrity guests, prizes, and more. We will offer premiere tickets, which will include dinner and admittance to the movie, and also VIP tickets, which include dinner, pictures on the red carpet, a swag bag, and more. You can purchase your tickets today by visiting our website at www.memoirsofapreacherswife.com. Seating is limited, so get your tickets now for Caught Up Memoirs of a Preacher's Wife World Premiere.